I was going to react to James Charles apology video, but just when I was about to sit down and do that, Krista and Alexis uploaded a video of their own. to a video that Krista, Alexis, and Easy and Natalie made together. That is the video that I posted and in that video I noticed a few things and I said that Krista is in a domestic violence relationship. Do I know that for a fact? No, I do not. I am not in their relationship. I am not there every day. I don't know what they go through. But in the videos that I've seen, there was noticeable things that makes me believe that. Now, if I am wrong, I have no problem apologizing directly to them and to their following and to my followers. But as of right now, that's what I believe, but I am going to watch this video and from there I'll say my opinion. Krista and Alexis uploaded a video called Domestic Violent Relationship Accused. Okay, accused. This is a serious topic, so I ain't gonna be cracking no jokes on this one, all right? Are y'all ready to react? Cause I am. Let's get it. I'm not like that. I would never hurt anyone. And what you guys are saying here is just, is just mean. I'm in an abusive relationship and our relationship is toxic. What's good, familia? Today we're actually gonna talk about some disturbing things and some concerning topics that people are talking about. Why the topics, I don't know, but it's about me being in a domestic violent relationship. Um, first of all, <laughs> do you guys see these muscles? <laughs> I was going to say thank you for that disclaimer. We know there's nothing there and muscle and muscles mean nothing when it comes to domestic violence. Good, I, I'm glad you put that disclaimer because it don't matter how big you are, a grown ass man can be in an abusive relationship with their petite girlfriend, okay? Yeah. Does he even look like I would be in a domestic violent relationship? Like, But I, I do like the fact that they are putting a little bit of sense of humor in this, so that's good. She will put her hands on me. <laughs> so recently we posted a video. It was a couple's challenge with Easy X and Natalie. Yep. And um, me and Easy were act acting like some bad kids. Childish. And Childish. Alexis for sure. and Natalie were getting fed up with us, okay? <laughs> um, Easy, by the way, was marking up the tables. Alexis was cleaning them, and Natalie was just like, oh my god, stop doing the video, whatever. <laughs> Enough was enough. Alexis started trying to take the markers from me. And when she reached over, I bit her arm. This violin music, though. <laughs> okay, I said I wasn't gonna crack no jokes, but I can't be me if I can't be blissful. Come on, now. The violin music, though, <laughs> in the background. Sorry, that distracted me. So let me go back to, to the beginning of her comment. Trying to take the markers from me. And when she reached over, I bit her arm. Right? Really excruciating <laughs> hard, if that's even a word. <laughs> what did she say? Excruciating? Oh, yeah. Um, it didn't even so look yeah, I bit her arm and her reaction was to hit me. I mean, I bit her arm and yeah, her reaction was to hit me on, her, on my arm. I'm mad annoying, y'all. I am so annoying and no, I, I can tell. feel like it's so funny to annoy Alexis because her reactions yeah, <laughs> are priceless. And y'all know her reactions are priceless, that's why y'all love watching her because like, she makes it funny all the reactions that she has. So like I make it my lifelong duty <laughs> to make Alexis annoyed. I think it's the most funny. That makes my days go by. <laughs> but now, like seriously though, y'all y'all make my wife look real bad, and I don't appreciate it. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Listen, none of us are making her look bad. She's doing it herself. And I'm not saying look bad. I'm saying these are her actions that she's doing, whether that's a natural reaction to your annoying behavior or not. I think what you guys probably should do is when you edit these videos to really think about what you're putting out there. Because if you want these accusations to stop, then maybe there's some things that you shouldn't show. Just saying. I'm, thinking that I'm just saying that as a viewer, as a reaction channel, that's what I'm saying. She abuses me and I'm in an abusive relationship and our relationship is toxic. First off, we just started putting our relationship out on, on online. Y'all have no idea who we are as a couple or maybe not even as individuals. Yes. Y'all see what y'all see on the internet. Facts. We don't sugarcoat anything because that's not our personality. Not um, we don't fake it. We don't fake it. 
for you guys to go ahead and love us. You know what I mean? That's just... And that's what I like. Whack. What I don't really appreciate is you're putting accusations, because they're not facts. You're putting accusations based out on there. Well, we don't know if they're facts or not, but you're right. I should have said, and, I, and I'm not saying they're talking specifically to me. They could be talking about everybody because a lot of people are saying it. And I just spoke from my own damn reaction. I don't, I don't go read people's comments on people's videos. I like my reactions to be raw from my thoughts and my thoughts only. I don't go off of others. I don't follow others' opinions. So maybe what I should have said is like, I believe that Krista is in a domestic violence relationship. I should have just straight out said, she is in one. The fact of the matter is, I don't know. None of us know if you are in one or not in one. So we can't speak factually. Yes, and you're, you're, you're titling people as something that's, it's not a joke. This is, this is not a joke. No, this is my life. And right. you're, you're putting me as an abuser, and I'm not like that. If you actually follow me in my journey. <laughs> the violin, yo, and the zooming into her face, though. <laughs> you guys, this is a serious thing. These are real feelings. Like, she is not faking this shit. She really means what she's saying. But I hate that you guys edited this video with violins and then you're zooming into her face while she's crying. It's so over the top and so dramatic that it now becomes entertainment. You get what I'm saying? But this is her raw feelings though. I mean, you can tell these are real tears. I've been abused. I've been raped, I've been molested, and I've been abused in many relationships. So the fact that you're even putting that title even close to my, my name, it frustrates me. That's the reason why we're doing that video because I would never do something like that. I would never do something like that to, to her. And the fact that- Or anyone. Or anyone. Moment for Alexis, thank you. She is very emotionally hurt. <clears throat> Alexis, I, Alexis, I'm sorry that you went through that in life, the molestation, the rape, and all that. There is no one in this planet that deserves that type of life. Secondly, I know this is a serious thing. I don't just throw shit out there purposely to hurt anybody because I myself have been in two domestic violent relationships. I actually got in touch with one of my exes from six years ago. You can actually click onto that video right there. I did a little interview with her because I haven't spoken to her for so long. And I, my intentions were not to ever talk about the bad side of things. But she went ahead and spoke on it briefly. I've been in those type of relationships, so I see the signs in the videos that I've seen. So I do take this seriously. And why would we put a video up of me being abusive or toxic out on social media? On like who does that if you because when you're that toxic and I'm not speaking about them when people are that toxic they find it normal it's the norm for them so they see nothing wrong with what they're putting out that's why Please follow who I am you know I'm not like that you know I'm empowering to all women you see this couple that's about to walk by? That's gonna be me and Alexis, <laughs> all right? So I need you all to stop trying to ruin this relationship, all right? You see that? Um, we might be a little bit closer and holding hands, but <laughs> we're gonna be walking like that, all right, y'all? We are not in an abusive no, relationship. We're, we're actually very loving. We're actually very honest with each other, um, very real. And we like to show that because, first off, relationships have problems. Everybody always, does. Always. Mm -hmm. We're not always gonna be that princess Disney couple that you guys always want to see. I just, that's because you're a queen. <laughs> I am a queen. <laughs> but we're just not going to show that. That's just not real and that's not what a real relationship consists of. So if that's something that you should want to watch, then that's something that- We you ain't for you! Watch. Yes, I have an aggressive personality. Yes, I'm from the East Coast, so we may be a little bit harder than the West Coast and down <laughs> South and up North, sure. whatever. That's how I like it. I like it a little bit spicy. <laughs> okay. from her Latina side, okay? Doesn't mean like I'm a bad person. Oh, and another thing is, is we've been together for almost eight years. No, and we're, eight, baby. Oh yeah, okay. Well, we've been together for eight years and we, um, we're not starting off our relationship with you. So we're basically having you guys join our relationship as we are now. And we're learning from each other now because we're still growing. Everybody grows every day. Relationship, individual-wise, whatever the case may be, but you can't just jump into our relationship eight years 
years into our relationship and think you know me or me or Alexis, you don't know us to the T. We love to share with you and that's why we are the way we are with each other and with y'all is because we want you guys to be a part of our family. It's not everyone, but the guys, the people that are stating it, the fact that you guys are stating that I am an abuser and you know I'm super toxic within this relationship is just crazy to me. I'm not like that. And I'm sorry if you don't understand my personality. Get to know her! But I'm one of the sweetest people that you can ever meet. Do I have an attitude? And I'm not saying you're not. Abusers also have that other side of them that are very sweet. Hurt people hurt people. I mean, even in that video with my ex, I let you know how good of a person she is. She's a great person. She was just battling some demons within herself and taking it out on me. Shit like that happens all the time. Yes, but I'm a ride or die friend and I'm a ride or die wife and I'm a ride or die mom. It's just my personality. This is true. I know I shouldn't care about what people think. But you're human. So but you I care about this just because it's been done to me and I don't want the world to view me like that. Especially if it's false. It's, Especially if it's false. I just, I'm not like that. I would never hurt anyone. And what you guys are saying here is just, is just mean. <laughs> I think what it is, Alexis, is that you're having a hard time controlling your emotions. Because you literally turn from peaceful, calm, to angry and aggressive. So there's no balance there. And this is when the physicality happens. It still does not make it right. That's not how you deal with things. And if they are not in a domestic relationship, I think Alexis might need a little bit of help with dealing with her feelings and her emotions. She's quick to react rather than staying calm and thinking things through. If you don't know who I am, then just try to get to know who I am because I would never do something like that. She's going through it, y'all. These comments that everyone has made, including myself, is really bothering her. Get some real shit. Okay. Come on, guys. This is the kind of stuff, the negativity that you put out in the, in the world, or the reaction videos that you put out in the world, and they're all fast, false accusations. It can really destroy someone's life. Um, so if Especially people who are actually like trying to be genuine and, and inspire and, and influence and find it. I'm trying in fun to ways. bring that into the world, and it's just it's very hard. And then the fact that a lot of people put my mental my mental illness into it, you know, when you don't, they don't know. I knew nothing about her mental illnesses or mental disorders. There was a couple comments letting me know that she has borderline personality disorder. I don't know if she has these mental disorders or not. Um, that could play a big part in her reactions and actions. But regardless, even with those disorders, being violent is not a characteristic. I have not seen any videos or anything coming out of her mouth that she has those disorders. I don't know. Like so she does. Me. Okay. Here you go. I'm gonna hit her. Right. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so she does have borderline personality disorder. Fear of abandonment, extreme mood swings, which is the reason why she does go from one emotion to another quickly. Unstable relationships, which I believe they are in one, okay? She has impulsive, self-destructive tendencies. Very impulsive, okay, that played a big part. Unstable self-image, self-harm, paranoia, disassociation, the disassociation I've seen because she's very reserved and quiet when she's around others. Uh, chronic feelings of emptiness. Okay, so she definitely, from what I've seen, the videos that I've seen, I'm not diagnosing her. She is saying that she has borderline personality disorder. But as you can see, violence is not a characteristic. So her hitting Krissa is not because of her disorder. Hurt her. Like, I just, it's just bullshit. I just can't do it anymore. I don't want to cry anymore. Just don't. I don't want to. I just, you know, we woke up 
this morning we were going to go work out, we were going to go to a couple videos, and instead I was making a cup of coffee and Alexis storms in and is like, people are saying this, this, that, that I'm an abuser, that Krista, you're uh, in an abusive relationship, and she breaks down and cries in front of Olivia and me. How would you feel if, you were, if your significant other came to you and said that first thing in the morning, and now we're having to do a video like this? This is the last thing I thought I would ever Come have on, to man. do. Come on, man. We're going to have an eating challenge, and we were going to eat the most bullcrap foods. I'm sorry, Tony, but it was just going to be for a video. Tony is our dietitian, and he's freaking awesome. But now we're having to do this, and my wife is crying because of false accusations, y'all. Come on. I love... Shh, you guys, you had to take responsibility for the videos you put out there. You are showing us this stuff. We didn't tell you, okay, okay, set the camera right here. Alexis, when Krissa playfully bites you, make sure you take a step back, smack her on the arm, and say, what the fuck? We are not telling you to do these things. This is actually, this is what actually is happening. If you don't want people to talk, because this is what the internet is, once the second you put your life out there, people are gonna talk, okay? This is the lifestyle you chose. I'm glad you're making this video and speaking to us about it though, because that's the right way to do things. And you're not bullying anyone either. Like you're not out there pointing out certain reactors or pointing out viewers who are commenting on your videos, you are having a general talk with everyone. So that I can appreciate. But it ain't our fault and why we believe what we believe. Yes, I'm annoying. Yes, she's annoying and she gets on my effing nerves sometimes. I get on her nerves sometimes. We've had issues in the past. We still have issues in the past. But that's every relationship, guys. Wake up to reality. That's what reality is. Life is not perfect. You have imperfections. And that's sure. what makes you grow as a person, as an individual, in a relationship, in life, in in, in your career, all of that. For so sure. stop when you see one thing, jump to conclusion as if our life is horrible and I'm going through some bull crap or she's going through some bull crap. It's not the truth. And I want you guys to be a part of my familia. But if And by the way, I wasn't just going off of that video. I've seen more videos than that, but I chose not to say anything because I didn't want to jump the gun until I saw more. And that video had me open up and speak on my opinion on it. I want to be negative and stuff like that. I'm sorry, I don't take that. And I, I, I won't have that a part of my life and I won't have that a part of my family. We love you so, 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 we so do. much. And that's why we created the YouTube because we want you to be a part of our family and our growing journey. And, you know, there's some people out there that are negative and unfortunately, if you don't want to be in our family, then just keep on moving. Um, you know, just it's all. No, I like watching you guys. <laughs> I do. I think um, you guys are entertaining, especially Krista. Like, she's very funny and goofy. I like to watch your videos, guys. I like watching Easy and Natalie. This is why I react to them. But if I see things, I'm gonna point it out. This is why I'm a reactor. I react to videos. Uh, here, and if you want to spread all that toxicness that you say, quote unquote, say we're in, that we're in, you know, or that negativeness, then don't go on our platform. A real relationship that has had had problems and still have arguments, and we're trying to show that it can still work and we won't give up on each other. And that's good. That's, that's what we're trying up. to show. That's and you good. Can still spice it up after eight. Years. And in every marriage, you should try to work it out as much as you can until you both can't no longer. Still have fun after eight years. That's something that you rarely see in a lesbian community. So understand that we're trying to have you a part of our family and our journey so we can show you that our love and that we're going to last forever. Stop being a bully. That's exactly what you no guys should be. No me gusta. You guys <laughs> are being bullies. I'm not a being a bully. I'm against bullying. I literally turn on this camera and react to a video. Comments In the comments of my video, they're going to say their opinions as well. I don't gather everyone together and try to gang up on somebody. That's not what I do. I say my thoughts, I say my opinions, and then I move along. On to the next video. No, I've been bullied for so long. I don't like it. I think for someone that's been Something like that, like it would never happen. And the reason why I've been 
aggressive and I don't have that personality because I had to go through so much in my life. Her people, her people. I've been through because I haven't shared my whole story. People who are in, who are victims of domestic violence can either be fragile and timid, which is the path that I ended up being in on my non-violent relationship. And this was in the beginning of the relationship. Every time my wife would do a, a quick move or try to get something, I was quick to flinch like that, not realizing why I was doing it because that's how toxic my previous relationships were. And I realized, oh fuck. That shit really impacted me. Or the path that Alexis are, which is the more aggressive side. That's all they know, so that's how they react. Well, I'm tired of you guys seeing my wife cry, and uh, me about to. <laughs> Bottom line is, guys, just, just relax, just chill. Um, enjoy the ride of our, our Familiar channel, um, enjoy uh, as much as we're enjoying it. Um, everything is fine on, our, on this side. Nothing's not going through anything. She's not going through anything physical. This is not an abusive relationship. We love each other very much. We would just appreciate if you see anybody that's trying to be negative about um, that video or this situation. Um, to just correct them and try to help them understand who we are as people and, and, and along this journey learn to see who we are as people because what you really see is how we really are guys. Only positive odds only y'all. That, right? That's all we know. That's all we that's know is all we want. Alright, until next time guys. This is Amelia. Y'all even put extras on this serious video. Okay, I see you. Whatever that is. Why are you gonna try to do that Chris? We have no because say I really have no sense. I don't know when to stop. I really do this for a living. Like that little bite that she's doing right now. That's the that's the playful bite I'm speaking of. She was playfully biting Alexis in that other video. It wasn't a real bite for Alexis to react in that way. This is a playful bite. Stop, Chris. Oh, oh fuck. Damn. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> Y'all are fucking crazy. And then you and then you expect people not to say shit. You see what I'm talking about? Even if that bite hurt, smacking her in the fucking face ain't it. <laughs> ain't it. Let's watch it again. Y'all do this to yourselves, y'all. Alright, until next time, guys. This is a Just when I was feeling bad. <laughs> you do it to yourselves. Come on, man. Yeah. Just because we have to stop, Chrisa, the fuck? No, oh, it's gonna hurt. Like, you gotta stop doing that, seriously. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my god. You're such a jerk. That was bad time. <laughs> that time you slapped yourself. Yeah, I know. Stop, you're not putting this in. I'm just like, oh, she did. She did, and because of that, she made the video look bad again. I'm guessing Krista is the editor. I don't know, but I still stand by what I say because it's still not okay. All right, you guys, tell me what you thought about this video. Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe, and please hit that bell so you can get notified every time I upload. See you in the next video. Peace.